Hi, my name is Tanya. I wanted to share what my journey experience meant to me. The game came out during a really difficult time in my life. I had just lost my father. He passed away a couple of months before the game's release. And I knew that the game was going to be really hard for me to get through. I knew it was going to be a tearjerker and I knew it was going to dance on every emotion that I had been going through because I was following the game, anticipating its release. And the game truly gives you a sense of solitude and despair and anguish and every other adjective that you could think of that goes along those lines. It truly does. And going through what I went through, it was really hard. The wounds were still fresh. And when you're lucky enough and you run into another player playing the game at the same time in the same area, you'll see a little other traveler off in the distance. And you can't help but think, they're going through what I'm going through. They just lost somebody and they feel that pain and they're here to lift that burden and we're here to comfort each other. So it's, um, it's, it's a sense of connection. And the interesting thing about it is that the person who is playing the other traveler, they're going through their own struggles in life. They could have, um, I don't know, lost their job or going through something um, in their life that's completely different than what I'm going through. But you take the character and you relate it to yourself, you know, and, and the struggles that ensue throughout the game. Those are your struggles and they're coming to light. And when you have that other person, it's so weird because there's no communication. I mean, you'll see the bling bling um, sound or you'll, you know, with little hieroglyphic like uh, signs of communicating. And you, there's no way of understanding what the heck they're trying to tell you. And there's no way of saying, hey, over here, let's go do this. There's no way of saying it. But in a strange way, you guys understand each other. There's that, um, there, there's no longer a communication barrier because there's that connection. And for a game to have such a different meaning to everyone who plays it and also can provide a deep multiplayer feeling than a regular multiplayer game because of that connection bond that you build with that other person. This is a lot. This says that that game is truly magical. And um, it's kind of, you know, with these feelings, I was pushing them back, pushing them back. I did not want to think about it. And I thought this is my way of handling it. And it brought them to the surface. And playing Journey was truly part of my healing process that I needed to go through. And it helped me. It's kind of like, as cliche as that sounds, a light at the end of the tunnel or um, the light in, or oh gosh, I don't know, hope and joy at the end of a struggle. Because it really did help me through the struggle that I was personally going through when I played the game. And this is something that I've been wanting to do for quite a while, and I just hadn't been able to do it yet. So perfect timing. I wanted to thank Genova Chen and everybody, the team over at That Game Company, for creating such a game that can mean so much to the player. And whatever struggle they're going through, it is truly, truly satisfying to... I mean, I can only imagine how gratifying it is to hear these stories. But for that, for being part of a, uh, my healing process, I thank you. You, The game lifted me. And as that transformation takes place in the game, the transformation with your struggles, it, it's just a realization of what needs to be done to, to better your own self, I guess. <laughs> the game is really hard to, to put into words without giving too much away. But 
again, I thank everybody involved for that game. It's truly special, truly magical. And um, that's what my journey experience meant to me.